Good morning, fellow Bia friends. Good afternoon, good night, good evening, depending on your time zone. This is Radio Biafra USA 2. My name is Maze Ike Peters. I hail from Newi. Newi is in Newi, province of Biafra land. We're broadcasting this morning live from New York City under the auspices of our mother station, Radio Biafra London. Our leader's name is Maze Namdekano. Today is the first day of February 2021. And before we proceed, customarily we have to pray, we have to ask our leader, city's assistance to pray. Uh, so also bow your heads and let us pray. Without whom we cannot function, and unto him we give every honor and every adoration wherever you are i will ask you if you are in the spirit to remain so if you are outside the spirit we ask you to come into it because what we are preaching from here is a gospel of redemption as directed by chukukika biyama himself in heaven and this very gospel we must preach it therefore we must pray we give thanks unto the O elohim for there is none like thee, there can never be any like thee. You are the beginning and the end. You are the Alpha and the Omega. Our lives are in the palm of your hands. We commit all that we are unto thee. We have come as the ancients did before us, as our ancestors did before we came to offer praise and adoration unto your holy name and no other. For we do not worship any idol. We do not worship anything born of a human being. We do not worship anything carved out of a tree. We do not bow down before anything molded with the hands of men. It is only thee that we worship. That is why we have come this very evening on this hallowed platform that you yourself created to offer you unadulterated praise and to hand over to thee all that we can ever become because Biafra is yours. This very family of IPOB, you molded yourself. You decreed that IPOB must come and now that we have come, that we may worship thee, you will him. Please accept our offering of praise and sacrifice unto your holy name because there is no other like thee. We will continue to adore thee. We will continue to worship thee. And as I said before, and I will reiterate, as we pray unto thee, that Biafra is your possession. We will sacrifice Biafra unto thee, that you may guide us in all that we do. You is only you that sees the hearts of men. If there is anything that we are hiding, if there is anything that we have concealed from our people, O oh Elohim, you will judge us very harshly. But if our hands are clean, our hearts very pure, you will bless IPOB. Then you will bless me. Then you will bless my family because it's a promise from you. All our hope and our trust is upon thee. May your name be glorified. May you be exalted. May you, O Elohim, be praised. Now and forevermore we pray. He say, He say, He say. All I know, I hope is ever for sure. One day we must be free. Must be free. Elohim, yeah, we told us to go. Your fry is guaranteed. Guaranteed. Yeah, they pull around, they won't pull around. Pray for peace to reign. Pray for peace to reign. We fell out of money everywhere. Pray for peace to reign. For peace. I got to sing. I got to sing. What you need to know, we don't miss guarantee. Let me tell you what you need to know. You come on, be free. Freedom. 
mass movement in the whole world by none. And we did it because Chukwoke Kabiyama is with us. We did it because Chukwoke Kabiyama created IPOB himself. And we are here to pilot its affairs. We will not prevaricate. We will not stop. We will not slumber until Biafra is fully restored to its former glory. Anybody in doubt as to our resilience and our determination to restore Biafra is not only mistaken, not only misguided, but needs to see a psychiatrist. Because we are not stopping. I am a Namde Khan and I don't stop until I get what I want. Yeah, 
your chest to send hospital. We love all the way out to bed this watch to be your slave forever. Oh, Nana, so we fought so hard against the system. Fighting against the system. We fought so hard against the system. Fighting against the system. But our lives have gone to war. And a very spot we left our work here. And check it in the Constitution of the Zoological Republic of 1967 to 7, 1969, sorry, of 1969 Constitution of Zoological Republic. The statutory is there, is a law, but they violate it, they forget it, they silence it, and allow Fulani to be destroyed. The warning, the, this thing is coming to those of them that claim that they are the governor or a list or whatever. Because we are saying this and not when it will rise up again. Idiot, nonsense. I, we will not listen to you. We are not going to take it. We are warning you now. And those of you who are sympathizers of these fool idiots, these criminals, parading themselves, these uh, Hitlers, these Okebekes, these Mayatiala governors, Listen to it now, that this thing is according to Zoological Constitution of 1969, statutory, that the full and men are not supposed to be parading their cows everywhere. You must hear it. Our leader put it on his Facebook. I'm just reading it out. Maybe you don't have access to the Facebook, but you are listening through the album for you to hear it. Not when it will start, not when we will react. People like you will begin to talk rubbish. Listen, he continued. The bold step taken by Yoruba governors in banning open grazing in their own region is uh, commendable and uh, as such must be reprosecuted and cons consolidated by a similar pronouncement in the East. Your own counterpart in the other region has done it. He is telling that Yoruba has done it. So you don't need to say, is it only us or whatever. Let our people learn now, because some of us are foolish. Some of us are idiots. Some of us, we don't reason. Our brain knows the work. When it will start now, the casualty may affect anybody. It has not happened, but it will happen if you refuse to work according to this instruction. The, in the Yoruba land, now in the Juduwa land, the whole Western governors have agreed that they don't want that opening grazing. They don't want Fulani to be destroying the farm of their people because that is the only source of living for their people. They don't want Fulani to be raping their women, their, their, their mothers and all those things. They don't want to hear such a thing. It is signed and sealed in the Western uh, uh, Nigeria. It is signed and sealed. Why can't our own? But we know that our own are puppets. They are slaves to Fulani. Okay, but will not talk. Hitler has given 500 million to Sokoto. Hitler will not be aggressive and command to shoot on that area. You know, Mehti Allah, governor of Anambra State, will not talk because he is Mehti Allah. Mehti Allah is his secretary, his PA, and everything. Therefore, mine is there, smiling like a, a woman that wants to fall in love with somebody, whereby he's preparing himself for 2023. He will not do anything. The midwife we have in Enugu State he cannot react, he won't talk, he will only declare fasting and prayer. We are saying all these things, the, the hour, the hour in, um, in, in Abia State will not do anything. He will only be buying house in Australia to send his children there. Listen, our people, we are saying this thing, we're giving the last warning. Our leader has said it. We don't care who the ox is go. Bullet may hit you on that day. Because if they know you, it will happen, it will happen, brother. Because we have come and we are not going back. If they refuse to declare this thing, write it and sign and seal it, just as it happened in the Europa, now we go write them and now we go sign them. For those useless activists, make sure you are listening, you have heard it. It is according to the true constitution of 1969. It is there. 
Make sure you are listening because when it will happen, don't come and be writing on. We, those you write up doesn't move us. We don't care. But we are telling you in order for you not to come and cry and say this, that. Because you will see hell. Something was just happening in Orlando. Some people are talking. The EU, if they refuse to do what we, they say it's democracy. The power belongs to us. It is what we said. According to democracy, it is what we said that will happen. If they refuse to give us what we are looking for, you will see more things that are more deadly and dangerous that have happened before. You will see it happening. You will see it happening. I just want to take this little time. I have now to put it direct to you. If, you are, if the governor is not listening, you need to take the message to him. And kneel down as you are worshipping him with his ill-gotten money. He beg him for them to make sure that this thing is being done. Because if you know his governor, he will hit you or hit your own children. You will they eat for his table. We are telling you, brother, we have come to restore the emperor and nothing will stop us. We don't care who the office is God. We will do what we must do to be free. Write it down. There, there, according to our leader. I continue. Our leader said, if after 14 days, there is no firm and decisive action by Eastern governors to ban open grazing on our land, ESN will step into the bridge to commence their enforcement of this 1969 act anti grazing law across the entire region. Don't say you were not informed or given prior warning. <laughs> this is why I love our leader. He's an intelligent man. <laughs> Madam Namdekan is an intelligent man. Is the, the zoo constitution we are acting now? For you to come and say, uh, oh, they, they do this thing. Yes, and no. We are acting according to the constitution now. Because there will be a day when His Excellency will run. He's coming. Tell His Excellency for him to sit, stay a bit. It's better he, he break that bondage. He break that relationship with him and the Polani and sign this thing. If the full army call him, say, what are you doing? He tell him that, Oku Diova. That is why we are signing it. So that these people, we don't want this cow, whatever, inside the street, inside the market. Look at some pictures. Cow, inside the classroom. Cow, cow, inside the classroom where people are studying. What, what does that mean? What does that signify to you? Listen, my dear brothers, we are saying this thing for what will come. Because all this is news, the way we are causing people this, that, this, that, we don't care. Because it has of this pain that our freedom will come. So if you don't want it to happen, begin to tweet now. Begin to call your excellency. Begin to call them. Begin to inform them. Call their PAs and whatever. Tell them what we are saying. Short and simple. It is 14 days and it, it must be. Because men are ready. There is no any man with his own right sense that has conscience. That will sit down and watch his mother, grandmother, mother, sister, wife, daughter being raped by some uncircumcised Philistines inside the bush. There is no any able man who will sit down and watch his son being butchered, killed. There is nobody who will borrow money, go to farm, invest it, and somebody come and destroy it that will keep quiet. And we are those people. We are those people, IPOP, under the leadership of Onyen Dumazin Namdekan, are those people. And I hear Kwechirigo, we are letting you to know, because if you refuse, we don't fear them, they are nobody. Listen, brother, they are nobody. We are not afraid of any idiots. But you, Excellency, and what, they don't have anything. You see your Kebeke, you see Mwike, you see Meeti Allah Governor, we can go there and carry them for hand when the time comes. So, for peace to reign, let them do this thing now, now, now. Whether they call themselves South, 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 or whatever, we don't care. They created by themselves. It's not anything for us. We know where we started, where our boundary is, and where we know where it ends. Let them speak to themselves and make sure they do the same thing the Europeans have done in their own area. Everybody is listening. Not when it will happen now. You won't calculate. You will not process your brain. Your brain cannot process very well to analyze, to think things, to fix things how it should be. Rather, you would just join or be influenced by anybody, any right or whatever, to be pitying your own enemy. You know what happen? No? We don't want that kind of feelings. We don't want that kind of emotion at all. We need to fight to free ourselves. We don't want this full and nonsense anymore. We don't want full and nonsense anymore. 
It must stop and this is the time. This is the time. Are you listening? Take your message to your excellency. Warn him excellency for the sake of our own or what? Because when this thing starts, it will escalate to what you don't know and what I don't know. But whatever is escalating to, we are not afraid of it. We have been prepared. Get ready to die. We tell you that we are dead people walking. The message is very clear. This is a very straightforward message from our leader. And we are waiting. I'm counting. It's 11 days more. <laughs> Every single day. I told you I have some piece of Stones that I put in every day, I throw away one, and then we're still waiting for them to do something. They have to. They have no choice. We are not begging. We are all not creating a new law. We are not going out of law. We are following the law of the nation that we call Nigeria. It's a Sutare law, and uh, you have to obey it, whether you like it or not. We're enforcing it. We're only enforcing an existing law. We, we, don't, we are not creating a new law. We are not going against the law. We are not being. We are being law abiding. Actually, we are not uh, being an, being outlaws as the way you think. But whatever you think, that's your problem. When the day is coming and you don't do anything, ESN will enforce it, and that's it. As simple as that. What we're doing, we're going to enforce the law. And our our, our leader speech this morning, I just read up something which is very interesting. It has to do with what I wanted to talk about this morning because yesterday I had a video of somebody who was rap rounding from Isikwato. <laughs> I was like. You guys can find out when I, after playing that video, I never said a word. I just thought it off and just want to do something else because, you know, somebody sent it to me. I didn't listen to it prior to, but then at least I don't regret even air, airing it because that would tell you how stupid and silly some people are. Let's read this. Our leader says here, if you are one of the zoo animals suffering from an advanced form of Stockholm syndrome, may it kill you there. We in the East are not, has never been, and can never be slaves to any bunch of retards. Ask the British. We <laughs> have remember when they came. At least malaria started with them then. Eventually, we took over what was left. We won't tolerate any iota of killer Fulani headsmen menace in the East. You may be comfortable with your wretched, Fulanized existence where you are, but we won't live with that rubbish in the land of the rising sun. Where were you when our people were being slaughtered, raped, and kidnapped in Isukwato? Talkative lunatic everywhere. <laughs> Idiot that I was talking yesterday about rousing, blah, 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 blah. He had, he remembered that uh, Sunday Buho. Uh, it's, in the, it's in the West, but he doesn't remember that ECN, ESN is right on the corner. He never said something because he, these are paid people. Don't worry. <laughs> the point is that you guys are not sleeping anymore. I'm so interested because even yesterday I had a call from somebody who, those who think that they knew that, they, that we, we're all um, people that have no brains. That they were the ones that have brains, but we're still watching them. They are the ones calling me now. Not me, they call. Now then they call me. Uh, they want to hear from me and know what is going on. I don't know what is going on. So turn on to the radio. Our leader continued, in less than two weeks, ESN will commence the full enforcement of Nigeria anti-grazing law in the East. That's exactly what I've just said. <laughs> in less than two weeks, of course, they will go out and walk. And do. They are enforcing a law. We are not breaking any law. Turn into a cow, then see what shall become of you. We are about to understand how determined we are. You have the temerity to talk about monopoly of violence. All these years, Fulani murderers in your zoo, army, and police uniform have been killing Biafrans. What did you fools say? Why did you not open your stinking mouth to condemn your alamajiri? has his bad police. Did you not see them publicly destroy privileges? What billions of Naira belonging to Biafrans in full view of the public? Cowards and hypocrites. The era of Biafrans crying and, crying and lamenting to EU and United Nations has come and gone. The dragon flag has been raised. If you don't know what it means, go and ask. By the time 
what is about to happen is concluded, you will see Somalia as paradise on earth. Yap all you like. Hire every inch column of the zoo newspaper as you like. There is no going back. You zoo animals are about to witness a type of madness you have never known before. This is our leader speaking, Mazin Nam De Kanu, the indomitable <laughs> Ohamadike. I love this. When I see things like this, it turns me on. Come. The zoo, we are still waiting. You better do what we say you should do. Better you do it in peace because if you don't do it in peace, we will enforce it. We have our ESN Eastern Security Network. It's going to enforce this law that is there in existence. We didn't create any new law. And the so-called law panther or whatever they call it, that area, we are going to look into it too. So you people should start packing your luggages right now because what you will see you will, is something you will never experience. You were looking for war, 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 war. I can have colonels now, so we are still waiting for you to be able to disobey our orders. Then you see what we can do. We are going to be as mad, madder than you. You know, it's like uh, you are being crazy all the time, but now it is our turn to get mad. I am still going to go back to that rabble rouser, that idiot I was talking yesterday. In fact, I saw something that um, um, Simon Ekba did which is exactly what I wanted to do. But eventually, I thought I was going to get that clip and use Simon's Ekpa's clip. But since I didn't get it, I'm still going to go back there and do, do the analysis on my own. But let's listen to that guy, you know, the person that, that thinks, you know, they are smart. These are people that, that are smart. I wonder about if we are misgrads. Like I said, oh, analysis in here one time. A small, when we were little, I had this friend when he's eating, you will see him dodging the meat. Ona kuchako fenako konako. Owe ba no no pachapia. Uli chazi ya wama mwema. Uli chana mnyo asya mwa wela ano. Ndiya now, what they are doing, these idiots that think that they are very smart. He's talking about this yukwata. Look at how selfish he is. They are raping women and children everywhere in Biafra land. These people that call themselves, that think they have something, they are not talking. Oh, Nam, the Kano doesn't know how to do it. Oh, we know how to do it. Now he's crying, rabble rousing. And you know something? But we don't care. You are nobody. We don't even know who you are. I don't. Let me, let me, let me add this so you can really know who I'm talking about. Because I need win. Watching me um, this particular period, anytime mm -hmm. you are watching me, I want to thank you so much for watching this video. It's, it's, been, it's been a while. I have tried to see if I can keep quiet. His name is MNK Urebu. That's what he called himself. I tried to see if I can just look away from it. But it's becoming a more and more problem mm. for us. You want to look at what? From Isukwato local government area. The insecurity in Isukwato local government area is becoming extremely, extremely frightening. Listen to him. He's concentrating on his local government in this area, in his tiny little Isukwato. Sikwato is Biafra land. There's no doubt about it. But people like this, we have ESN. He did not mention, just listen to him. He never mentioned ESN. He's talking about his little Sikwato as if his Sikwato is, is outside where he's, he's outside the territory of ESN. Because he doesn't Scary. Want and it calls to question everything that the people of Sikwato is known of. We are called the land of generals, mm -hmm. but obviously the insecurity in the in the local government has made us land of I don't know what to call it again. Mm -hmm. It's it's it is now land of probably puppets. Mm. I don't understand. It's a problem. Kidnappings in Isukwato has increased consistently. Mm -hmm. There is no road now that you can use to drive into Isukwato and your heart will not be in your intestine or you will not get scared. You are a coward. Uso Bula, Icho Ejigi Isukwato to. Ezube Gubina to. I have said this thing, this is on social media, I said, probably until one prominent person is killed, maybe from between Uturu to Isukwato or maybe from, from our colleague to Isukwato, or for maybe from Unnunya to the main town, until one prominent person is killed and blood, a serious blood is shed 
then that might be when the people will rise up to defend themselves. Oh, do we need a Sunday Ibo, Idoho or Iboho in, in, or Iboho in Isukwato? Mm -hmm. I don't understand. What exactly is the government doing? What is the local government chairman doing, the new elected one? What I want to, this, this is very, look at, you see where he's going? Sunday Iboho is in the west, southwest. The brave young man in southwest. Now he's talking about Isukwato. We have ESN. Isikwato does not is not excluded. He's just talking. But my brother, you failed. You are just a failure. You're making a mess of yourself. <laughs> we are beer friends. We are smarter than this nonsense you're doing. You keep on rapping, rousing. We are listening. What exactly are they doing? Mm. Nobody is making statements. Nobody is making any move. Yeah, because Nobody you are full and you slave, the idiot. There is hope. Nobody mm. is doing anything. Yeah, no, man. Look at this vehicle here. This is a brand. This, this is a Range Rover mm. that was shot pieces on that same road. This is a Range Rover shot on that same road. You can see bullets everywhere on this Range Rover. Every part of it. And I gathered that the person that drove this rent over, they were kidnapped and they paid 22 million naira. 22 million naira. Mm -hmm. Just yesterday, somebody was killed on that same road. And nobody is saying anything. Look at it here. We are this saying something. We are ESN. ESN, we are, our leader is saying something. Keep on rubbing, Aka, rubbing your mouth. Aka, which is in the Sukwato local government area. Nobody is saying anything. Mm. No statement from government. No statement from local government chairman. He has not been, the local government chairman has not even visited this place. Mm -hmm. No statement. No action plan. Nothing to tell us this is the plan they have to protect the people. Nothing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if there are kidnap cases around this area, Kidnap cases, they have not gone less than, less than 50 kidnap cases. And kidnappers have collected not above 100 million from that axis. My media house, AF News, we have gone there some time ago to, 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 to expose the, the power of that place. Mm. What exactly are leadership doing? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. The police officers you see there, they'll only be parked at the particular station and they'll be collecting money from 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 from, from motorists. Nothing again they do. Meanwhile, kidnapping is still going on. It is becoming very scary. And how do we expect our sons and daughters who are staying outside this state or this country to even come back home when this kind of crime is going on? Every day, between our colleague to our car, there is always kidnapping cases. Do you people still want me to continue with this garbage? This guy is an idiot. Complete idiot. Complete lunatic. He said he has a, a media house. <laughs> Onyenka. These are paid stooges. These people, I that one day the chicken will come home to roast. <laughs> That's what it means. He's coming closer. He's so scared. His, his heart is in his intestine when he's traveling. Ah, ah, <laughs> Why would you have to be your intestine? I thought the killers are coming for the for the misgrants. I didn't know they come for people like you guys. You know, those of us who don't have a job, jobless people, IPOB. That's why he has not been able to open his mouth. He's in the media, according to him. I have never listened to his media. I'm hearing for the first time, but I know. Believe me, trust me, I know. People that have listened to him, these are the people that will sit down and condemn our leader in their media. Aya kowa 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 bawe ugusi yabacha. I call you on from here, left, right, and center. Oh, why didn't he come back to fight his people? He is making the Afra outside. Of... These are the kind of people I'm telling you. Don't quote me. Don't say. But I bet you, I have never listened to him. To be honest with you, I have never. But I know. From the fruit, we shall know them. When you see the way he's talking, these are people that don't see, that never saw anything good in what we are doing. We have an outfit, a formidable outfit, that even people outside the East are wishing that they had something like that. We heard what Dele Momoto said. He said, Namdi Khan is formidable. He speaks Queen's English and Toknadu. That's what he called him. It's money job. He said, "Why they kill money? Until somebody prominent is killed. Oh yeah, 
So when they are with Buha, then the world will react. There are people whose life don't matter. Listen to yourself. I want you to idiot sit down and listen to what you said on media. The reason why he's laborizing, I'm telling you, fear has engulfed him. Now he doesn't know how to go back and say, oh, Namde Khan, what he's doing, we should support this ECNO, ESN, because they, they are the people that, that, are, that, are, that are there volunteer to serve. No, he won't say it. Because why? Because in the past, I am saying it categorically. Some people will call me this morning and confirm what I'm saying, those who have listened to him. These are the type of people they sit down, they are rabourizing, they think that nobody is also, also harm my faith. But you know something? The coming of Biafra has proved to us, many of us, that there are more idiots out there than you think. Onyala, Onyala, Jenny example. Ojerebana Akuzu, and he looked at the dead body lying there. People were crying and knocking their head on the ground. Onyala, Nekata, Nekata, see, never had do. Don't talk to them. They are a bunch of fools. I see no Onyala. He's not Onyala. He was an intelligent person. Because you know that when that dead body was lying there, none of you helped them. None of you cared about it. Now he's dead. You are professional mourners. You come there, you, you cry and die. They give you one bottle of coke and rice. They nabbing. They talk about up a up a up a chicken. I want to have a drink of chicken. The dead body, the madman is just look at all of you hypocrites. That's exactly what this man is. These are the kind of people. He has a media house. What has he contributed to stop this menace in his area from his media? He won't. He will not hear. He would rather be on the other side, condemn what our leader Mazin Namdikano is doing, to get the, to be glorified by the by his masters. Today, the same people are haunting him. He has his his heart in his intestine when he's traveling. That's why he's waking up from slumber. Let me just let me just round this thing up because I don't want to dwell on this. He's mad cases every he's, single day. Yeah, he's been there before. Why? This why? video, I'm not here to just complain. Yeah, it's <laughs> not just about complaining. Mm. It's about Asking leadership to rise up to the occasion. Which leadership? It's about telling the people of Isukwato that it is time to rise up to the occasion. Oh, yeah. We cannot keep sitting docile. We cannot keep sitting and waiting for leaders to take action. Mm. If they want another Sunday ball to a match on Isukwato, let us do it. Mm. Our people must be protected. Yeah. We cannot stand up like they being killed in this way. Mm -hmm. mm. What are we doing? You see, this is what shame causes. <laughs> If we want to solve the boho in the Sukwata, we should rise up. He does not want to say that ESN is there. <laughs> On our fear, because of what the past utterances. That's why sometimes I tell you guys that silence is golden. Sil we want silence. Especially somebody in the media like this. When you have been talking, people have been recording what you're saying. Some people are out there now saying within your people, because you have probably you are media, you have to have followers. Some of them will say, wait a minute. What is this man talking? If only you could now a big honor since these are the people that have been condemning. So what he doesn't want to twist up is to go and say, uh, why don't you listen to what Nam Dekan is saying? No, 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 no. He can't say that. That would be the same thing with uh, telling uh, 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 who, who am I going to use as an example? He's just Shetima Yarima or Yarima Shetima, whatever they call him. He's like telling him, telling us, why don't people listen to Nam Dekal because he's telling, saying something. No, 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 that's the kind of people. These are the people that sit down there. There are many of them. And I'm telling you. But now they are beginning to wake up. I tell you, they call me. There are people that never want to ever talk to me because I'm part of this. No problem. You know, go normally young people they tell them oh, you didn't see the war uh, because you football if I got it. But some of them know that I was in the war, so they can't even tell me my alphabet because I was in it. I was part of it. So they can't tell me that. They, what they tell me is uh, I got as if not being a I got is a is a curse. It's uh, old age, oh, old age, I will roll you. There's an old age is a sickness that you cannot ever heal. Of course you can heal it. It will come. So the point I'm trying to make is that these people, these are the kind of people who think that nobody knows anything. They are very smart. Neko se abuku and I around. If you know on a bottle, on a cockle, 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 on
could have been summarized in five in three minutes support esn support what namdekano is doing ndi sikwa to binienu to win ego kai ewe india protect your wan here cry on esn to come to your aid that isikwato is being besieged stop crying all this is sunday boho you want to bring it to who who will start, will you know, start it yourself start a movement in isikwato it's affecting you now that's why you're crying and you are crying and making a fool of yourself because you, you are not a reality now going with you you're lying to yourself yesterday i wish i could put my hand on what what um, um uh, Simon Ekpa said about this. I thought I had it, but I, don't, I couldn't find it this morning. Because these are the type of people we need to talk to. There are many people like him. In fact, there are more, some of them who are actually secretly looking for yesterday. Believe, trust me, yesterday I gave, I, I, I link, I gave two people link the way to pay money for ESN. Because they don't want to come. Oh, you know, I want to do this. And I don't want people to say, we don't care, my brother. Anya can go that level. You want people to know, fine. You don't want people to know, fine. Give us the money. And make it short, make it quite short. Because you are going to throw an half. I will expose you. Because I know you, I know your status. So it's better you don't even make any donation at all than you make an embarrassing donation. So you go in there putting the money where your mouth belongs. These people have come in there, ESN, they have come in there to protect us. Our leader is talking Nadu. Oh, the way that the man is not playing. Who oh, is a fraud? Who oh, is frauding everybody? That one is dying off gradually, gradually, gradually. All the comments are going to be after those things now. Because the reality has down on everybody. Oh, yeah, and now they are those people. He's still struggling. What can I ban Nika? He might go somebody who's trying to drown. no, 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 so if I need they did the killing in his quarter didn't start today. He started with the little ones, according to you, unless unless a prominent person dies. Those prominent ones are not living in Sukwato. Where are they living in Abuja? They will live in Abuja. They might not even come to Sukwato in the next 50 years. So if you are waiting for them to die, I want to hear in Sukwato. What you should address your people is young people. Listen, any of you who can volunteer, if you're qualified, they may volunteer here for they are they are human beings they are young kids that you're talking about there are kids that have said this enough is enough we want to change the system we can't leave this thing for our children they voluntarily go in there that is even already creating panic for the past generals they're telling you volunteer army is the is the army that you can never defeat because they are not going there to fight to go back and make a salary and make an income. No, they are fighting to die. It's either they die or they stay alive and get what they want. So you can't defeat them. If you are trying to fight them, you are wasting your time. This idiot that is talking here, that is making all this noise, I'm telling you honestly, you should call the Isikuato young people. See, listen, Anya Savior, somebody has come in to save us. This IPOB. Join it. I pray by you if, if Spencer gave for, but they wouldn't say it because these are the same people that have probably in the past criticized. I'm go, there's a Chinese saying that says, if you are going north and your intention was to go to the, towards the south and you discovered you were going northwards and you've made 1,000 miles, the best is for you to make a U turn. You can never get to where you're going going through that north. No. Make a U-turn, go back towards the south. So you can get to your destination. These are people that, they rubble them. Okay, at the beginning. Yeah, they can't, we don't like him. Oh, he's abusing everybody. He's cursing everybody. He's cursing people. Nam they can't, he's cursing everybody, including cursing even himself. <laughs> he's, he does not exclude himself in the curse. So the curse is just, he wasn't cursing anybody. He was just tearing you up. Look at the way you are even rousing this man that is talking right now. You can't even be bold enough to tell your people you are there, we are all dying. Our mothers are being raped. Our daughters are being raped. Our mothers cannot go to the farm. These people are messing up our life. You can't say it. You know, I book around. Or do you want us to have another Igbo uh, um, uh, uh, here in Isikwata? What stops you from having Igbo? Oh, is Igbo, is uh, what is he? is he? Is he not a human being? You are waiting to use him as an example. When right there on your nose, our leader Mazin Namdi Kanu launched the ESN. 
Eastern Security Network. This is something you should have asked your youths that you're calling on them. Tell them what to do. Go out there and join. For those of you who have money, support these people. Then cry on the ESN. Now that you're making, like if you have come in here and say, please, ESN, we are dying. Now they can't help us. Help us because we can't travel in Yusukwata. We can't go from here to here. We understand that. That's commendable. But you know something? You won't do it. Because Namdekano is, you are too much. You have a media house. So you can talk. Media house, a local media house. And poor media house, and you put is nothing. So when you, when, you, when, when you don't have anything to say, swallow your pride. Take that your ego and brush it. Brush it, put it in the toilet and flush it. Come out openly and cry for help. Genuine help. After all, ESN, Ishikwato is not excluded from Biafra land. Ishikwato is part of Biafra. It is a land. It is our land, our precious Biafra land. And ESN, that's what they are all, all in for. You make a genuine cry. Be honest about it. Be straightforward about it. But if you like a quick mayor, because you know what? In the past, what have you... Well, even your conscience won't even let you do it. Believe me sincerely. Because you have, must have spoken so badly about what we are doing. You have condemned the book publicly and internally. You have internalized it in your conscience. So your conscience will bother you. When you want to open your mouth to say, come to my, come to my help. You are asking yourself, who am I asking to come to our help? Now they can whom I have condemned. Because your, your inner self knows what you think. He will always tell you, you see. Look at you. You are not crying to, for the same man that you've been condemning, the same man that have been nothing, the same man that is a misgrant, the man that is a fraud, the man that is this and that. You are crying for him to come and help you. That's why you're rabble-rousing. You're jumping around. You're calling your government. Which government? Do you have any government? As if you don't know that the government was not doing it. You are the people that they pay. They use you. Now you are, so, you are calling on them to come. Come and do what? They didn't do anything when they could. Is it now that they, that they even themselves are running for their dear lives? You think they can do anything? Come on. Come on, man. You, you, you guys are just, just, this is, like I said yesterday, I, I, wanted, I wanted to look at this yesterday, but I did not because it took me on away. And after listening to it, I went back and I listened to it after the program and I said, this man needs to be talked to. These are the kind of people that we don't really know what he had done in the past. Oh, my media. You have a media house. What did you use it for? What did you use it for? You are not, you are not telling your youth to rise up. Rise up and do what? Most of those youths you are calling anyway, they are already members of IPB. Those of them, they will look at you and say, look at this idiot. You didn't even know where you are. You are waiting for a prominent man to die. That's when you will speak. So prominent men are living in Abuja. So who is again? Even you are saying, you, are, you already said it that some of them will be afraid to come home. Of course, they don't need to come home because of people like you. If you have spot them, if you have been very strong, there's nothing that our leader has given them 14 days now. I know when you come to Sukwato, probably there are cattle so wrapping around the whole place. Who are these people that are robbing you? You think they are, they are regular arm robbers? No, they're not. They're not. They are targeting you because you, are, you, you, you invited them. Your consciousness brings them. Because you are not supporting the truth. You lie to yourself and you think that, of course, the darkness will always, the Satan will always infringe into a place that is dark. He doesn't like to want the light. The moment you start speaking the truth and the light in the area, all this robbery will stop. You are asking for help. I can see you asking for help. You are crying for help. For the people of Isikwato, it's okay to cry for her for them, but you know something? In our hour, you are not being honest. You are not being straightforward. You are not making sense at all. All you are talking about is uh, uh, rising, up, telling the youth to rise up. Where is the government? Which government? You don't want to come up plain and tell the government that they are bullshit. They are not doing anything. No, you are calling on them to come out. Come out and do what? Look at government chairman. What is he going to do? Look at government chairman not there. You want him to come and bother with you? No. 
He will stay there, probably build a build house in the Sukwata and then live in Abuja. <laughs> For him, that is a safe heaven. But when it happens, all of them will run. It's time to come. They are, they are beginning to get, get themselves ready. I was thinking this morning, some of them should go and get a good sneakers because time for running a runner. Time they will run. Let us we have great people. In the Sukwata, we have a military base. Yeah. We have police headquarters. We have DSS. Mm. We have a what do you call civil defense yeah. we have almost all kind of security mm -hmm. but still yet still yet mm. we have one of the top military officers all over the world does that retired some... and seven mm -hmm. does that does what that... are we doing yeah. what do you think that all these things we have all the generals all the top leaders in the... my brother stop fooling yourself i got in a car in a car janka let me stop this thing because I don't I don't want to keep talking about this this idiot because we all know that he's not making any sense either. He's not making one single sense and there's nothing we are going to waste our time and energy talking about him. John E S N. Tell your Ishikwato people if you want to cry for her for them. I, I know our leader has listened to you. Probably the ESN will probably go over there and help. Not because of you, absolutely. Not because you're shouting, because you're not making any sense at all. I wish you were just there alone with your family so they can come in there and take you out. But because of the our brothers who live over there, our leader probably will consider the fact that we have an ESN, ESN that is a security network. They will take care of that problem, trust me. Because now that you have said it, the army is living there, they have an army base, they have this witch base. Who are the people robbing you anyway? Do you know who they are? You don't. There are the people you are crying. Do you think that you are crying? To be forewarned is to be forearmed. Stop fooling yourself. There are many people like you. I'm just, just, I'm just using you as, as an example because you, you actually made a video. There are people like you out there who think that they know. But gradually, like I said, some of them are coming back to reality. Some of them are just joining the, the what we are doing. They are no more interested in, in hiding uh, under the coffers of uh, one Nigerianism because that one is gone now. One Nigerian story is not uh, Odie Uzi. <laughs> in other words, Odie Uzi, nobody talks about things like that anymore. So what we are talking now is our freedom, the freedom for everybody freedom for all this is radio biafra usa 2 i'll take a very short break come back and i open up the line for you to make your calls stay tuned oh na na land of the right and sound john love i my original From the east, south, and the middle, great be a fan for me. But the killing to I don't worship and, and we lost the faith of our God. And as we want Lord in I don't worship and the British entered in, hey, training on the Niger, exploiting your people. Trading my battle, you give me palm or you learn the soup to the internet. I brought in civilization, brought in your religion, and told us about America, and we embraced it. I never knew. Got a tear of water. With religious pitted us amongst our brethren. With 
denomination Tear us apart Building churches Schools and hospitals We love and we are to pay this point To be your place forever Oh, no, no So we fought so hard against them systems Fighting against them schism We fought so hard against them systems Fighting against them schism But our lives have gone At a very spot, we left out where we got. Now is the time to be restored. Great Piafra be restored. I want freedom for my people. Freedom, freedom for Biafra. All right, um, back again. Uh, this is Radio Biafra USA 2. My name is Maziak Peters. I hail from Newi, 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 Province of Biafra Land. You can make your calls at 646-920-4541-570-3528442-1929-406-9953. Uh, like I was saying, let us concentrate on... Uh, and our support for our, our, our darling ESN, they are here to stay. There's nothing anybody can do. They can hate us. They can talk and curse. Our leader has given them 14 days, which I'm counting. It's left about 12 or 11 days to go. They have to remove all the curtains, enforce the law, actually. This is not like we're making a new law. We're not being outlaws. We are trying to enforce existing law, a law that is there already and uh, we need it to be, you know, enforced. But if the governors cannot do it, our ESN will help them <laughs> take care of that problem. It is not a problem, actually, but what it is is just as simple as enforcing a law, a law that, that is already made, that has been there before, and uh, there's nothing anybody can do to stop that. Let's see, I have a call coming in on WhatsApp, the first caller this morning. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Good morning from here. Good morning. I know Bruce and I am Miriam. Good morning. Welcome to the program. Yeah. Uh, my name is Sefan. I call him from Houston, Texas. Uh, uh, thank you, Koki Kabiyama, for the new month of this year. Again, the second month of the year. I thank God for his grace and message towards his children the last month, bringing us this new month. We thank him. We honor him, we acknowledge him, we appreciate him. We thank him for the life of our leader, Maze Nande Okukano, the man that he wants to use to liberate his children. I pray that blessings of God shall follow him. Yes. The blessings of God shall overwhelm him. Go around him, cover him in every way he goes. When he open mouth, Things begin to happen in the name of Chukuki Kabia. Yes, I pray. Yes, Maze, uh, this this um, clip you played this morning is annoying. Yes, it's annoying. I wish that guy is around. You know, it's just like uh, some people, you know. Uh, we are creating another security outfit, our own security outfit, like uh, our Jews, um, um, okay, Zip, as I saw his own, he created his own security outfit. Our people are just, I don't know how to describe our people, some of our people. Look at this, this idiot from his supermarket. Nobody is talking, nobody is talking, nobody is talking. What is, where, where is he? Why don't he talk? Is he not a human being? Nobody is doing anything. Nobody is doing anything. Uh, where is he? 
Can't he do anything? Okay, now he's referring to he recognized the uh, Sunday that Sunday bo yeah. and that. Oh boy. Because um, it's not somebody that you, you can recognize. Yeah, I think uh, your line is uh, having an issue. You're calling on uh, WhatsApp. I think your WhatsApp, the WhatsApp is either yours. Uh, I don't know what I say. Your Wi-Fi is probably not having a problem or somebody's trying to call you on your line. That's uh, all right, this is Radio Biafra. I have to turn you off. Okay, you're back again or you're off. All right, let's take another call. Call us back when you're done. Uh, caller on um, Straight Line, good morning. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Good morning. Welcome to the program. Good morning, sir, from Gambia. My name is Sonia. Yeah, happy New Year. Same My to name you. Is Buchi. There I'm will. calling from Gambia. Yeah, I'm from uh, Aguilera. I'm from Aguilera. Aguilera is normal balang. Jaffa land. I want to thank you too for... Say that. Deep down, deep down. Say that. Deep down, deep down. Hello? Yes, I can yes. hear you. I'm, yes, I'm still here. Our people, our people, I know for, I know for the Bundeban, I know for the Bundeban, I know for, why is Namode Khan, why is this man, why is this man, why is Namode Khan doing all these things? I know for the Bundeban, come by your soul, why is Namode Khan, who can barely break the Biafra? I know for the Bundeban, one of uh, our brother here yesterday, I talked to him about Biafra, this thing, restoration. He said, uh, we should not fight. After if Biafra come, now they will not join us. And ask him, what did Biafra do you? You will not come and join us by this time. Now is now it's time. Come on, come and support ESN. We do we liberate our people. Now was say uh, uh, the brother, one of your uncle went to went to uh, Germany. Now money can slap him there. He's talking about Ike for the money. Ask him, Ike for the money. Now money can not even see him. They are talking about Ike for the money. Only question they ask him, they not even beat him. The man I was saying, but, but, but I open my phone, I show him, I tell him, look at him, only question they ask him, they don't even touch him. I started lamenting uh, this one, this one. He said, Namu, they can't do this one. I tell him, no problem, if he says karma, it's good for me. If he used to eat people, no problem, it's good for me, he's my leader. It's what I tell him yesterday. The man was talking, but, but, but. he said he cannot support. I tell him, no problem, don't support. But anytime Biafra will come, I will tell people that, I tell this man to support Biafra administration, he said, no, he cannot support. What our people is, every, every day kill our people, he said, uh, now when the can used to insult people who will help him to restore Biafra. Um, hey, let them go and sit down. They don't want to spoil Biafra land. They are saying that now can used to insult elders in Biafra land. Which elders? We don't have elders in Biafra land. They are saying elders. Those elders, they, now when the can used to insult people who will help him to restore Biafra. Um, hey, let them go and sit down. They don't want to spoil Biafra land. They are saying that now when the can used to insult elders in Biafra land. Which elders? We don't have elders in Biafra land. They are saying elders. Those feathers, they, they will to insult everybody. If Namun can insult people, yes, he's good. Let them, let him insult them very well. So let everybody will get up. Yes. Every time they kill Biafran people, every time they kill Biafran people. The, the Biafran blood, is he good to, 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 to slaughter, to waste every time? Biafran blood, is it precious to Nigerian people to slaughter every time? Nobody's talking. Namun can have reason. Get up. Tell people to liberate our people. Our people don't want to stand up. My side, Peter. I know who I know for the Bundeban, I know for the Bundeban, I know for the Bundebo, Masnon de Bundebo, I know for the Bundeban. Yeah, I understand. Thank you so much. There you Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much for your call. This is Radio Biafra USA, too. Uh, let's see. I don't know what's wrong with these phones. They are not really behaving uh, very well this morning. Uh, let's see if it's going to come back on. The phone just called off himself and. Uh, all right, this is Radio Biafra. We're still taking calls at 646 
It appears that our our coordinators and our principal officers are not using their line. They, they rather choose to run from their line. I don't know why, because this line, I'm not even sure if it is still functional. It hasn't <laughs> rang for a while. Um, let's see. Uh, they just uh, 929 We're also on Skype, Skype and Signal. The Signal line is 845-283-9665. Actually, that line can take signal, it can take uh, WhatsApp, and can take other, uh, other platforms on the 845. Let's take this one. There's a call coming in here on straight line. Good morning. Yeah. Tell us your name and where you're yeah. calling from. Yeah. Good, good morning, Mazze. I Peters. Metsuku Okike Biyama, bless you. Bless the whole principal officers of IPOC and bless our leader. Mazze Nandi Okukano Ngozi Chuku. Mazi, my name is Mazi Chime Mere I am from Abadje in Wangle local government, Biafra land. My brother, <laughs> this clip that you play, we have listened the clip from from one a clip from in Sukuata that lamenting like a like a, a, a paraton. Hey, nobody's talking. Hey, kidnapper, fifty kidnappers, shot long driver. But those those guys are talking that thing. Those those guys are the, one of the idiots that criticizing our leader. When our leader told them that these people will kill people, since how many years now? Now the car have started saying this thing, review this thing because of jealousy and envy that will kill individual. This jealousy and envy, let them be go and mark it. Mark it not their their fragile eh? Omaru. Ten years, Zibo will wipe out in surface of the earth. Jealousy, I quit from jealousy. That greedy, that greediness, that jealousness will destroy in Zibo in this life and land their generations. I'm telling you, uh, he said, uh, uh, Sunday, we, do we need, do we need another Sunday Boho to come and uh, you recognize it, Sunday Boho. Why your brother here is saying this thing for long ago? You did not support your brother. But now you are, you are, you are lamenting. Like my brother that comes say he's talking about somebody say when the after coming with us. My brother, anybody that around you talking about that, put record, put record of the voice of that person. If possible, you know that man keep on your side. If the days of record will come. You see this fight, this fight will go all around. Oh, yes. We must separate that. Anybody that talking rubbish, if possible, my brother. You know that person, record the voice, keep it for evidence. Time shall come. I got more yes. And we are not afraid. What kind of man you see this thing they are talking now? This land will burn. It's not a threat, it's a promise. I come on a boss on all nobody has for man before we read from Egypt. Many things work for God. Many things work for Tuko Gabiama. So shall it be this time. And many things is going to work in this battle. They think that it's 1966 or 1960. No. Many things will work. People are going to see the kind of technology. They did not expect that this technology is working here in our midst, in our Biafra land. People are going to see it. Before the white man call it technology. Yes. And the only they know for that one can also, no matter how little it you may call it. Because David is just only used to catapult, only catapult and five stones and destroy Goliath. I use the matches of Goliath and cut, his, or cut off his head. So shall it be. The history will repeat itself. Mazi, may Elohim bless you. Bless you Therefore, is here. Thank Our you. security artists have come to stay. And he have come to stay. All these governors, all these prominent people man that say they, are, they have money. Go and watch what happened to in, in our law. How soldiers are running. Governors, you will run more than soldiers. Yes. All these people call politicians in Boland. You people will run more than soldiers. We are coming one by one, step by step. And then you are Thank you very much. Thank you very much. This is Radio Biafra USA too. Having a nice conversation this morning. Yeah, I like a brief. Just call when you call. Speak, say what you want to say and make room for another person. All right, the number here is 646 9204541 5703528442 plus 1929406 I have a call coming in on um, 
on signal line. Okay, that person dropped. Just call us back. Uh, person on signal. Unfortunately, your line just dropped off. All right, like I was saying before, we have all the lines are open. Uh, 579-845-283-9665. That's another line coming in. Uh, uh, have a call on straight line. Good morning. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Caller on straight line. Are you there? All right, that call has caller has dropped. Let's let's take another one. Uh, caller on uh, signal. Caller, good morning. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Good morning. Welcome to the program. Happy New Month, sir. Welcome to the program. I'm from Malaysia, Daddy. There was a this coronavirus, uh, coronavirus, and uh, everywhere. In fact, we don't supposed to worry about it because I want our own internal virus. Nalabai was very deadly than coronavirus. And ask me what that virus is. Our own virus, oh, envy, envy and jealous, envy and jealousy, envy and jealousy. Our own virus, daddy. Yes. Any, any, any. Amam, amamote, amamote. I go away. That, that, that virus. I <laughs> Honestly, oh, oh, the very deadly, deadly problem. Deadly virus. I, I am not I'm a motor guy. Yes, look at the look at the rubbish that that that, that idiot on an no. Only for how many years? For how many years I was leader on board? I got some name on it. He was in born today or tomorrow. That he have been hearing what is has been going on all this while. Just on Sunday, he bought a Yoruba media very popular. I go on your chatter, your chatter. Can you imagine that kind of insult? Sunday, he bought a Yoruba media very popular. Because he's a brave guy, no doubt. He came out to defend his people. Yes. That would do the person did do to chetra. While ESM non abake there. That means that this person has been working with the uh, uh, Kokezi Bazo as the yeah, one of, of Fulani. Course, they are, yes. Exactly, he has been working with Kokezi Bazo now. Yeah, yeah. That is the simple truth today. But because of this, because that the thing that men are fed in a village, yeah, he can't enjoy it anymore. That is the simple truth. These people are demons, honestly. I don't know what to say about them. But God will punish them one by one. Amen. Because he has already gotten to them. It will it will get, it will go down on them very soon. Well, without no wasting your time, sir. I just I just have one one song to sing to my leader Mazen Go ahead. And then just I, I make, sign make, out. Make it very brief, sir. Go ahead. Yeah, one one song I want to sing to him. <laughs> Akara ijibu wa na madapu ichaya Mapu jelosi wa ne munka uberoku Ajo mona sabotu wa ne menankete Ayabu nandi wa nandi kalu Nandi kalu o ayonogi nanya Chuku bikego Obi kego dingwa uri megi de ginke gagani u chuku bi kego obi kego dingwa uri megi de ginke gagani u rejo bia frabu college biko mutanye o ai tu do dere ginde o sa dere o thank you very much for your song beautiful song all right this is radio biafra usa two we're still taking calls at six four six nine two zero four five four one I can see there's a call coming in here and um, coming on the other line. Is it on Skype? Looks like it's a Skype call. And uh, we're trying to pick it up. But unfortunately, I can't find a way to pick it up. Please, I don't think uh, that we need using the Skype anymore. Just use every other line, not, not the Skype, because uh, it's, not, uh, it's not behaving well. Uh, let's see. The Skype line is not actually behaving well, so we'd rather tell you to use the signal line. If you're able to make your calls on signal, that would be wonderful. 
will pick you up as soon as your call comes in. But meanwhile, let me take this one that is coming in on straight line. Call out on straight line. Good morning. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Good morning, Mazi Peters. My name is Chijoke. I am calling you from Austria. I am from Anambra province of Jaffa land. Welcome to the program. Kebema bless you. Thank you. Uh, Shukukeba bless you. Bless your family. Bless our leader. Bless our Jenny Biafra. Um, I thank our brother who just sang this song for our leader. Uh, I was really touched by that song. May God bless him. As you see what we are talking about uh, concerning the so-called journalists. Uh, the, the truth there is that all these people have compromised. They are one of the people that join us together with Igbo leader, Igbo governors to sell out Igbo people. Well, we thank God for the redemption that God has decided to, to give us through our leader, Mazin Amdekano. So without wasting much of your time, I want to call on, I want to remind our people this morning, the need for us all to be on Twitter to support our leader. Our leader is doing a great job. He's really doing everything possible to set us free. And the least we can do is to support him by retweeting him and uh, I want to call on all media officers. If you are a media officer in IPOB, I want to remind you this morning that one of your jobs is to make sure that not only that to follow our leader on Twitter and retweet him, but you must also share the link immediately after retweeting him. Share the link in your various WhatsApp or whatever platform you are in and encourage your members in your various zones to be on twitter so that we can get this thing done this is not for one person alone we are not doing for our leader we are doing for ourselves and the earlier we come out to support him the better for us and if you are not a, an ipob member you are not in any way laying down your life in Biafra land like the our volunteer in esn are doing you are not contributing your money you are not doing anything even to retweet on Twitter. Follow our leader and retweet. You are not doing that. Then shame on you. Then you will be one of those that we have to lie to their to their children that you are we are in the forefront fighting for their for for their freedom while you are not. And lastly, I want to say something. I want to send a strong message to the woman called Aisha Yusuf. I don't know where she's coming from, whether she's from Edo or she's from the North. She should stay clear from the affairs of Biafrans. She is talking about law. Do, do, is there any law in the zoo called Nigeria? Do the Fulani headsmen, Fulani terrorists, working everywhere in our bushes, killing our, our, our mothers, raping our, our people, kidnapping our people and killing them, do they know what is, what is called law? Do they respect any law? Where were Aisha Yusuf when this Fulanese killed our sister in Igbo land and, and, and cut her into pieces? Where were this Aisha Yusuf when this Fulani are busy committing all sorts of atrocities and their, 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 their people in the government were keeping silent and supporting them? She didn't say anything. She said, never said anything when, this, when the, the northern, when, when the, the millions of Igbo properties were destroyed in, in, in the north by his his bad police she never said anything this is how you put hypocrite critical people can be this is how they connived against biafran's doing 67 and 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 what that tried to wipe out the whole entire biafran people if not for god she thinks this is 1967 she should mind her business because we are like wounded lions she thinks she can fight if we come after her let nobody tell us that she's a woman Let's her mind her business and stay clear from whatever that has to do with Biafra. Thank you. This is what I want to say. This is just a warning. Thank yeah. you very much. Okay. God bless you. All right. Thank you so much. This is Radio Biafra USA 2. We are still taking calls here at 646 uh, I am still imploring all the... Uh, caller, good morning. Are you there? Caller on um, yes, personal line. Good morning. Good morning. Yes, I'm so sorry, Mazi. Uh, my name is Mazi, my man, Ugo Nejaka. Mazi, um, I am at the National PRO of IPOB here in the United States. I am from Amibo, Amibo in Olo. Amibo is the home of the Tiger, and Amibo is the home of King Jaja of Opobo. Mazi, I thank you for all the things you do for Biafra every day. 
Master, I want to tell you that uh, the principal officer's line is not working because I've been okay. calling. And, yes, I call and then it doesn't go through. There and this is the reason why I'm bothering you here now. Anyway, okay. Master, it don't set. It don't set. You know, there everybody is crying. Time have not started on. Master, the blood go flow. Believe me, because these people refuse to understand that there are some group of people that five million children were starved to death in that country. Nobody was remorse. They did not address it. They swept it under the rug. These people should understand that there are some women that were butchered and their belly was open and the baby was taken out of their belly and killed. Mas nobody said anything. It become business as usual. These people should understand that there are people that have been, you know, determined that they're going to be exterminated in this world. They kill us like roaches. They kill us like animal. Nobody cares. And then now, the time is coming, oh, man, the time is coming. I am telling you. And there is no way, there is no, no place that is going to, they, they're going to hide. We're going to go after house to house, room to room, and we're going to sweep them out. Especially the saboteurs in Igbo land. It's a saboteurs in Biafra land. We are coming after them. Now the children have risen. The children that has been put in a, a type of a restriction, the children that did not know what they did, that they have to be punished like this. The children that have been subjugated in that land. The children that have never seen any better in their life. The children that have done everything that their parents told them to do. Go to school, better yourself, learn the handwork. They did everything, but there's nothing to show for it. These children are up now, and they are going to ask questions. All these elderly that are talking and yapping and yapping and yapping, let them be ready. Because that time is here. Believe me, there is God everywhere now. Everybody is going to have gone. Honestly. And there is nobody that has that audacity. Or the person that will say, oh, that you have that right for life more than any other person. So where your rights stop is where our own stand. So what I'm telling now, telling people now is the youth in Nigeria. If you don't say you are, nobody will tell you that you are. If you want to live because these people are playing with your life, the only way you can survive is for you just to take the matter into your hand. For the person that wants you to kill, kill that person first. And that is what is going to happen. But let me tell you, for the army and the police to come after you or kill your brother or kill your sister, listen, have your own weapon. You know your weapon? Your weapon is just to take a bottle, a bottle, fill it with no fuel. Fill up the bottle with fuel. And then when you just turn it like this, bam, either in their house, bam, either in their car, or all of them, they will run away from you. So everybody has to be ready, because now it is blood to blood. Now that time of talking has finished. So the, what I'm telling you is that now ESN is in, in town. Our ESN is in town. And I am urging you, if you are a Biafran, even if you are not a Biafran, and then you want to contribute, please, I would like you to contribute the ES, you know, ESN. Our ESN number in America here, if you are here in America, no matter how you hide, you can hide anywhere, but time is coming, you're going to come out. So please, if you are hearing my voice, go to our website, and that website is www w.ipob in usa.org slash donate www.ipob in usa.org slash donate as you are donating god is going to replenish it thank you and god bless you Mazi. god bless you too my brother thank you so much all right i'm looking into that because i'm i've been wondering why that uh, line is not ringing uh look i think it looks like it has a problem so i've restarted it i hope it's gonna work Nine two nine four zero six nine nine five three. Whoever is going to call there, please do because I want. I'm checking out the line to see what the problem is. All right, this is Radio Biafra. We're still taking calls at six four six nine two zero four five four one five seven zero three five two eight four four two. The principal officer's line is nine two nine four zero six nine nine five three. Our brother just complained that the line is not working, so I've been able to restart it, and I'm thinking that it's supposed to work right now. So I don't know if until I get a call from any of you guys. On that line, 929-406-9953, I'll, be able to, I'll not be able to tell you whether it's working or not. Yes, my brother, uh, the, the point is that people have to realize that uh, we have come to the point of no going back. There's nothing that will take us back in what we are doing. Biafra is our goal. We are going to get Biafra, whether they like it, they don't like it, it doesn't matter. It doesn't make any sense. It's not going to change anything anyway. 
that's that's the normal language that we use and uh, when we say things like that it means that we have come to rubicon we're, we're at the point of where we cannot go back nothing can make us go back there's no doubt we are here to actualize biafra and biafra is what we are going to actualize without regardless of what anybody says all right i have a call coming in on straight line let me take this one call good morning turn down your radio please tell us your name and where you're calling from Good morning, Mazi. Hi, Peters. Good morning. Uh, sir. My name is Chijok. I'm calling from Maryland. Welcome to the program. Yes, sir. Um, I listened to the clip you played, though um, the clip was out since yesterday. We have been dissecting it. Yes. Um, what I want to encourage Bia France is, uh, yes, we can be reactional. But let us know that what is happening now is a war of wisdom. We use our wisdom first, as our onion has been doing. That man is, is, is really unique. Mazin Nandikal is unique. If you listen to what the world outside Biafran land, look what the comments from our Duduwa brothers, you know that that man is somebody they wish to. I wish we have somebody like that but what i want to say now is um our brothers who are living in the north far north where you know you are in god because these people they are good if they want to kill you they'll first of all show you the sense of same uh, accommodation they will accommodate hey no hey people no we are safe here you don't go anywhere ah, you are no problem you are shocked now lie, our people in the far north, you have to understand. I'm not saying that the, the, everybody uh, outside the Biafra land should come back because there are places where evil are. What our Supreme Leader said before, anywhere you are, they fight, you fight them back. What is happening now, I have seen their, uh, uh, their comments and their reaction, even what uh, the governor of uh, Kano State is saying, what the, the man is saying, this man, that those people are very, very dangerous. Hey, no, we should not. Yes, I know he wants to seem, he want to look, they, they want to play a politics that the whole world will look at. Even the Northerners, even the Fulanese are against uh, their brothers. They will say it in the media, but in their secret meeting, they encourage them to do that. Now they know that we are faster. This game has turned against them. They can't say anything. It's our people now to be very careful. Those who are calling, if you have anybody in the far north, when I mean far north, you understand what I mean far north. Where all these guys are, call them. You are on your own. Don't because of one or two naira games you are making there and risk your life and you think that we can be enslaved because of you there. You are lying. You are, in fact, you are telling yourself a big lie. That is what is happening. ESN needs support. All the time, uh, the man who is saying, you, many of us don't know what is happening currently now in Nigeria. You see, in Nigeria now, they are bringing a law that is even impossible for you to comment against Fulani, in fact, about Fulani killing. Yeah. So, um, yes, we know we're going to attack this uh, brother, but sometimes I was pondering, after the attack, I have given uh, my own uh, way of doing that. I ponder, everybody is enslaved in that country, but they don't know. You can't say anything otherwise. If this young man, because he is uh, benefiting from the media of uh, the zoo, if he has said otherwise, by now he would have been the first person. But now, our people, I want us to call, uh, that's why I'm calling, look at our brothers who are the final, tell them their realities. What happened during the Biafran war is about to repeat. Don't let them massacre you and your family that way. That's what I'm calling. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, Jora. Thank you for your call. This is Radio Biafra. I have another call coming in on WhatsApp. Call on WhatsApp. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Mazi, I see that. Uh, good afternoon from here. They will. Thank you. And uh, good afternoon to Biafra. And friends of Biafra and lovers of freedom. My name is Mosfebo Anibo, and I come from Ozobo. 
Nne wu province dia from la. And I'm calling from Kingdom of Netherlands. Mazi, I must thank you for the good work you're doing. Chukwa bi ama bless you Mazi, and also to my leader Mazi Nam the Kanu the Great. He recover our own time. Chukwa bi ama who has sent him to do this job will continue to lead him so he will direct us until the plan is restored. Is it? Mad. Yes. Your analysis this morning is uh, is great, and uh, I just want to make a response to to our people or to some fools that are sympathizing with our killer. I really don't know what is wrong with our people. These guys are these guys are been massacring us. These guys they have been killing us, and now God. Have set up Eastern Security Network to defend our land, to defend our forest, and some fools are already now complaining. Likes of Aisha, uh, you see, and some Igwe fools are already complaining. When we only, we, if if is this. Killer headsmen, they are the one that had the opportunity the ESN had. These guys, they were even kill, including the humans among them. But these fools that are lamenting now, our men only dealt with their cow and they are crying. People that, that have been killing us, as in, we are now as if there was no hope again. Yeah. And now ESN has come to do the needful, and people already. Commenting, I assure you, Sue, if you say that no one has monopoly of violence, so what has stopped you, the the outside minorities, majority that, that has become a minority now, what stopped you guys from standing against the flames? You people don't have the the courage, the act of envy. This woman envy. This thing is now extending to north so because. From what this Naisha said, I think that is the, the result of envy. All of them are envying a with their Igbos or ESN can be in the north. That is, by the way, I, just like our leader said, that they have not seen anything. And the 14 days, the ultimatum, is, is three days is already gone. I think today is the um, remaining 11 days. Mas, another thing I just want to say is concerning the announcement our brother, uh, Mas, you go need your economy made concerning uh, the uh, to support over the years or months i've been thinking that that very uh, ipob in usa.org slash donate is only for people in america that, that has been my thought but after watching a video by simon Epa on how he's playing the advert of that same account or that same uh, web you can donate I just said, okay, let me give it a try. And the thing works successfully. That means you can donate with that very www.ipobinusa.org slash yes. donate. That's right. You can use it anywhere in the world. I pay my dues here in, in, my, in my family here, but I just say, okay, let me just see whether this will just work. You know, I can just chip in something there. And the thing was fine. It just debited me. The only thing the people need is just maybe your MasterCard, the Visa card, debit card. Once you just put it in, you can make it real call in every month. It takes a, you know, a little token. So I'm just uh, urging our brother, Ugonidia, can let him, you know, maintain that this thing you can be, it can be used anywhere in the world, not just those in America. Despite we paying our donations here, we can still give out little, of which I did, and it went successfully. And I made it real calling. So every Monday, a little token can go to that very account. So uh, I just urge beer friends also that each and every one of us can do this also. Even no matter how much, no matter how small, now amount is too big, now amount is too small. Together we can, we can, we can do better and we can do great. Imagine. Thank you for giving me the time to question. Thank you so place. much. All right. This is Radio Biafra. We're still taking calls here. 646-920-4541. I have a call coming in on, uh, let's see, calling. Let me take this one on um, on a private line. Call her. Good morning. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Are you there? Call her. Good morning. All right. Uh, okay. Call her on um, 845 
2839665. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Mazi, thank you. My name is Kelech Mazi. I'm calling from Lagos. Welcome to the program. Um, thank you. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm been listening to your program, especially that clip you play, played about that uh, guy from Abia State. Mazi, yes. do you remember what Bible said that a prophet is not recognized in his own land? Of course. Do you know that if our leader happened to be from Aosa, the so-called Igbo Eflefu will be going to the north to bow down and worship him? That's right. Do you know that even the senators today, they got those uh, uh, sophisticated, uh, uh, educated moron will be going to the north to bow down for him? Look at this guy. He's calling a uh, Sunday. What do you say? This is uh, a Yoruba Ibo, Ibo, yeah. man. So, uh, Ibo Horo that just uh, started talking about his people yesterday. He's all the way from Abia State, all the way from his Ipuato. He, he left his brother from Omaha that has been fighting since 2012 that we know. See now, he didn't remember that his brother was the one that even put the fire that Sunday is uh, is using now. He, he, if he did not recognize all of those things, it's now uh, calling on Sunday. And let Sunday go and fight a... Uh, Oh, yeah. assuming uh, Mazi, sometimes our leader is a very good man. Oh. <laughs> if I am the one, which I know I can never be the one, I will not send ESN to no. to that village. No, that, I that's this not, man. Because, not because I would have uh, allowed this man. Not because of him. He is only one person. He is nobody. So. You, you see, but at least they should have kidnapped his mother or his father <laughs> or even raped one of his sister before he will get sense because this man if you watch from the beginning of his clip he said something he said he has been shining away from this he didn't want to talk about it uh -oh. he didn't want to talk about when the Fulanis are killing people in a Faruqui Beko in the name of a Bytom dance in the name of a crocodile chicken in the smile in the name of tortoise walking they have been killing our people everywhere he was shining away it's just because they're beginning to kidnap people from his village now he found his voice to the media this is the real this is what has been killing our people until he get to the adopters oh he, he just our leader is a very peaceful man that is why they are taking him for granted that's what the man that have more than 10 million men that are ready to lay down his life their life at any time they are taking him for granted but i know one of these days their eye will be open. Their yes. eye will open very wide but i pray for them that when their eye will open it will not be inside grave because if their eyes open, it happens that they're inside casket, inside the grave, they will regret much. These people will not come at that. What stops him from using that in stupid media platform to tell the people of what you call in that is village to support ESN? What yeah. stop him? These are the people who are calling people from their village and hey, don't join ITOV, they are miscreant, don't join ITOV, they stay away from trouble. They're now those people is calling where we are there where people are kidnapped in their village where are those people that is praising now you now cross all the way from Abia State coming to Ibado to look for Sunday and Sunday let Sunday go and go and go and go and pursue Flannis that is is is, is, is a, 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 a this man this man must only we begin to fish them one after the other I know God will keep exposing them but until we begin to fish them one after the other they will cause more havoc for us. They will cause more havoc. But I know their cop will soon fool. Yes. Their cop will soon fool. Right. Mazi, thank were. you very much, Mazi. Thank I you. am very grateful. They thank were. you very, very much. Bye bye. Bye. All right, this is Radio Biafra USA 2. We're still taking calls here at 646 920 441 570 plus 1929406 and 9953. I have a call coming in on, uh, let me take this one. Call on WhatsApp. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Turn, turn down your radio, please. Hello. Yes, good morning. Turn down your radio. This Hello. Is, yes, I can hear you. Okay, sir. Okay, okay. Good morning here. Good morning, sir. Welcome to the program. Yeah, I'm Mazi Ejiken by name. Um, please, I want to talk about uh, this our our brother, the the media man. The place that man is calling is from my place. Um, most of our youth. Let me just call seventy five percent of our youth are in IPOB. Yes, from Isukwa, right? Seventy five percent. 
our youth. Yeah? You are from Is Isukwato, yeah. Yes, I know that. Yes, I'm from Isukwato. Yeah, and I will speak my dialect still to my people. And for him too, because I know he will he will listen to this radio later in the day, or somebody will send a clip for him to listen. I will use my dialect to speak. Go ahead. Uh, no one will no, no one will after Bokarunu, Borogunu, Burikunu, Buribunu, Ahambo, Chiso Medica, Aumonia, Amiu, Amule Kuku. You want my work on your Kuno by Ankete, Onobla non Gobla non of Tabia by IPOB. IPOB, we have Kebasarai. Is it a new one or new one and the Kalu or two time mice? I le joke a guy. Uncoff Tala got one year Europa. Well, you need a name no new here. Upon you, we are Macalocasi, Pasulia, and your lady. Guru Jagoga. Ebola and the mother knows one, or be a cook. I let window mother get in under window mother won't call a beer cook. Who won't you go for a beer cook? Malanke, Mela Luwai. When you call her now twenty two million, there are one name. Woko, Oganda DSS retired on the Suquato and go. I go on the general leader on Ali, Waka Muni Suquato, Ule Bahana, Oko Mohammed Oboda, Hapo Shalom Mohangri, the teacher, Okan Dobo, Okamun, Okan Bagabi Abu, Ulu Zotapa, Zotapa Nungobla Nununo, Elazahi Lakoma and Aga School, Eleven Obla Lilene, Wolfto Poo, Wolfto Poo, Wolfte, La ECN. Kewe ya la zumbwe wa choha, akutu unu yeme le nuzo, uzo uzo akole. Ana mha punu nile, kaya nga liko guu na ha. Nuna achwa efa, tamu hivi yoko guu na ha. Ayo wende vili funde patale eko, ne importa me esporta sa. Nge hivi yoko guu na ha, kwa wade name of company unu. Apu. Oda, God bless you. There well, thank you very much. Thank you so much. Hey, well. All right, this is Radio Biafra USA too. Um, I think, but I think maybe you didn't finish what you were trying to say, but unfortunately, they, I thought you were done, and that's why, we, you know, the people in the Sukwa at all, like like you rightly said, I know that very well. The young people, I know they are members of IPOB, ESN. We are used to we are used to the bad luck all about ECN. So <laughs> everybody say ECN. No, it is ESN, Eastern Security Network. Please. Not easy yet. Support them. In the sequel, those of you who think you have money, support these things because you are protecting the last one. Forget about this man that is rabble rousing. He's talking. Now he is traveling with his heart in his stomach. He never reached. I don't know what you are going to do. So, what we are saying is that we employing our people to support. Forget about that man that is talking. He's just talking. We have a call coming in on a signal. Caller, good morning. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Master Peters, good morning, sir. Welcome to the program. Thank you very much, sir. Sir, brother, today I'm coming from South Africa. Uh, Master, have you heard that I'm going to be in the GB? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Dibia, Dima Nebu Dibia. Yes. Dibia no no no, and a Uri Abana. A Mariana Abana, Abana Jin Din Jin Kana the week, that I think water in the Kana, water yam. Yes. Yeah. Of one Ibian and a village, you found the Dibia no no no. On that, ya, he made a Uri Abana, Manobro and Kashi far distant, ya, the Uri his good sorrow water, Jacaraca. Manoga headed her. Yes. So, we have methods in the Bunu use Abata the good, what you are saying, and I did no no. Nani Uriaba, and Manakashi, if she want to young, we call water in the Tino, who wants in a while. One thing I learned from Mamas and Amdekan 
Obono, I want to see you to your night. That is, take it as our own idol. Is somebody that we love so much? Manama is each other, not that, but Namahi. Yeah. And then I'll call your call, I'll call you. Now, I'll call you, and I'll call right from day one. Of the terrorist, Kabobe, Miss Mandoka, even one year in a school, have the entire five, six, seven years has taught her. It's not up to compare. Man, I have me on na 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 television for Miss Grant. Mm -hmm. Yet it did not detect the name the name her name. So all you have done is on the IPOB, outside IPOB. She able to learn from this particular person. You may not make this my I do I adore you I adore this. You know I don't know she. Why did you write that name? I adore you. Here, that kind of work now you don't know. I never worry about. Yeah. In on a television where you name program now boy you roba. Less than two weeks ago, I put that on. I'm a boy on a boy Sunday boy. In a post on the Kobe and Norugog, rap was the one they go no no no. Okay ma, well I'm that chocolate no ya hand. Oh now oh now I feel you. I feel you should be okay. Man, my reason of calling this morning, I I get us. You go to San, you go to Senator San is Chahu Kogi ni kana boy. You go to Aisha Yusuf. No, they should know themselves and keep quiet wherever they are. If you don't have any affiliation, they should go. It seems like in that agreement, testaminating people. There are somewhere written agreement somewhere that when it began, every other person must support. I hear them now, including Dindi Bonoweha. Aisha Yusuf should know that uh, it is not end Sarsana and do with music and co drink. If you want to end the terrorists, you must have what terrorists have. Shouldn't be sentimental here. Aisha Korea, a woman warrior. The case on I fear on now. Oh, you have no news about you to tweet the rubbish. Just a couple of days ago, I was in the college. We heard it. Go by name, take it. My name is Hadi Kamadota. We change our phone here now. Unza. Kaya was to come down. Okay. Aisha is a woman. I'm not from Pakanam, Pakanam, one year ago, Nanibo, not quite long ago. I'm not Aisha Frey. Can you hear me? On Aisha Frey, we work almost mad. We work in the front. No, no, no. No, but then one day to me in a village. On Aisha Frey, which law did he give for any man in a bush? A reserved area owned by a government. January, January. This is when the campaign is done. The same this Ibos. Can anybody call on this radio or this one Nigerian list to do a program? Let's see the legacy that all Jews or Kalu left with the with the Abia State. But all Jews or Kalu legacy now would work proud that he established Ruga in a, in a, in Abia State. He was very proud of both. Just the achievement all Jews are able to boast for Abia State. But no, he, he was the one that established Ruga in yeah. in Abia State. Mm -hmm. Now. There's a tape you played, I think, yesterday or a day before. That man was interviewed in AIT. He yes. make reference to that particular thing that El Joseph Kali did. Yes. He, he, then he said that man make a good statement there, and that must be paid attention. If that trade continue, because he has come to stop that, because what El Joseph Kali did, El Joseph Kali, what he did now is. Is the establishment of the felonies in the day. So, of meaning course. every other governor should be following. If nothing happened, that is how we do. Would you law that give felonies to come? Okay, one make it, look at the Isba. Taking millions worth of drink, destroy it there. Aisha and the, the rest of them are there. The same thing you want to feel on now. Law, 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 law. Which law are you talking about now? Can you, this person in the law now, can you drive on a road now? Just by your motor. By your now, that's your cruiser now. By your to use a niche on a road. So Aisha should behave themselves and all of them. Anybody talk rubbish now should know that no sort of sign agreement came in and digo. And this is not end the start. You end with the code drink and dance. If you want to end the terrorists, you must have what terrorists have. God bless you, Ivy. God bless you. All right. Thank you very much. The point is that. Uh... Who is Aisha anyway? <laughs> you know, all these people, like I said, these tiny little lizards, when they think that they are crocodile and you help them become crocodile, that's when that's when they, they have time to do all this nonsense that they are doing. Who cares about them? Who is Aisha? You can tweet all you want. We know what we want, and what we want is Biafra, and we're going to get Biafra, regardless of what anybody thinks. All right, I have a call coming. Let me take this one. Caller, good morning. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Uh, Edda Ike Peter. Good morning. I greet you, sir. Welcome to the program. 
evening from here. I am calling from uh, United Arab Emirates. Yeah, well. My name is uh, my name is Prince Sunday Nawan. Uh, uh there's something there's a saying in our adage. Uh, yes. You see that man that that is shouting. That man is actually using style to, to call uh, call uh, Eastern Security Network to come and help them. That is what man is saying. Yeah, but and many should, people don't understand. Uh, but it should be it should come out openly now. About who you know? <laughs> yeah, you Ochoro, Ochoro, Ochoro. I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask you now. Ochoro, you just feel the way that you are. Yes. You want to go? Now, no, this is what happened. Based on what his uh, statement there, he said something that uh, he has been keeping quiet. He saw this why. Okay, he has been keeping quiet because. Eastern Security Network is not out there. And uh, immediately he knows that Eastern Security Network is out and they are in action. And he believed on what happened in Oro. He believed, you see what happened in Oro. That is why he came out to shout that they should not be looking at, uh, their people should not be looking at their government anymore. That this, this thing is getting out of hand, though they should come out and do something. Now, Last two days ago, I don't know if you have seen that video. Our our leader posted something on his page about the Eastern Security Network. In the same issue, they went to work there. Okay. Last two days ago, he posted it yesterday. You know, they went, I call our leader. Our leader is like uh, our leader is uh, is, is, is like a millionaire hero. On his royal job, there's a royal man. Oh, yeah, yes, yes. This, that, I I tell you, this is the this man now is among those that. Uh, Call our leader a all sort of name, yeah. you know. But out of shame, he cannot come out and mention our leader name for him to come out for him to come and help. He went uh, as far as to Yoruba land. <laughs> Sunday, who, who just came out yesterday? This man went and called the man. Is it? He said, "Did you want Sunday to come and help us here? Should we call us Sunday? You will to come and help us here." You see that if you want that, if you just listen to that man, eh, you discover that eh, the man, the man, are Yonas and Onoka and uh, and uh, Ochoze Eja Church. Mm -hmm. Are you getting me? Yes. So this is the problem. This is a problem our people are having. We don't value what we have. We don't value what we have. As you know, ya mama da deal na ben ya. That is what is clean and uh, Igbo, Igbo general. I'm not saying few Igbo, Igbo general, and it's in our blood. Mas, let me tell you the truth. You see, not an animal. You see, Janja with the house of Flani. They are feeling the heat of our mass oh, land. Yeah. They, oh, they are yeah. feeling the heat. Seriously. They know, they know, they know our world. Yes. They know our world. That is why whenever our leaders speak, any single word he speaks, they, they, they find it as a war, that our leader is calling for war. Any single, it's out of fear. Yeah. It's out of fear. You know, Thank so you. that is the so Thank the you. man the man should go the man should just go relax. We are not looking at his what well, is not even about his shout shout that led our people there. We are we are we are determined to secure our land yeah. and we must secure our land. Yes, sir. It doesn't matter whoever that is that speak. We don't do, we don't want to listen their their cry anymore. One thing is sure, Eastern Security Network is, has come to stay and nothing can take them back. Yes, very sure. Thank and you. at the end. Those who those who say uh, is not good must still speak good because on Kurunjo ye mete we come at the end. Yeah, thank well, you, Mas. Thank you so I much. Don't. All right, thank you very much. This is Radio Biafra USA too. We're still taking call at six four six nine two zero four five four one five seven zero three five two eight four four two plus one nine two nine four zero six nine nine five three. What our brother is saying actually makes a lot of sense because uh, we know the man himself that is talking. Uh, you might, like you said, <laughs> that's the point. We want to talk about our leader. Uh, these are people that have condemned him in the past and probably have spoken to a lot of people and the public have campaigned uh, vigorously uh, against our leader. But today, if like, now nah, let me go back to this man. Then there was the idea now nah, on the uh, youths to wake up. Which youths are they calling to wake up? These youths are your own people that you have been against them you have never tried to help them in the past all right caller i have a call coming in on um, eight four five caller tell us your name and where you're calling from good morning from here yeah good afternoon marzi i peters good afternoon sir welcome to the program thank you for taking my call thank you sir i just want to 
use this opportunity opportunity to add my voice before i commence i would like to greet dear friends all over the world friends of biafra lovers of freedom i salute you our leader is martin and i salute you good day from me as i do i remember by charles speaking from my location marzi i peters let me add to what people are saying um this woman called aisha yusuf can someone trace back her state of origin if somebody could give us her state of origin who is she who is this woman this aisha that is she's, she's that uh, <laughs> woman with a uh, hijab that uh, covered her face like in the most she's a muslim by religion okay. she was in that oh boy what happened to your line it just cut off your line just cut off what happened uh let's see too many calls are coming in so i don't know which one to pick actually all right, it looks like your network failed, and unfortunately, uh, you have to call us back. That's what it says here. It says network failed. And uh, network failed means that it has to do with your system over there, not mine. All right, call us back when you're ready. This is Radio Biafra USA 2, 1-929-406-9953. This 9953 line is working at the moment, so you can use it. Any of the principal officers can use it and call me on there. I don't really know why this line just messing up this time. Caller, good morning. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Caller, 845. Yes, my brother, I Peters. Thank you for picking up my call. I've been calling for more than since last week. I've been calling on the principal officer's uh, line. And um, I'm glad, I, as you confirmed, that the line is not working. Even in this very private line, I've been calling too. And um, uh, I know that a lot of people have been calling anyway. Yes. And you cool. don't give a preference. So, but, uh, however, whatever happens, I'm glad uh, that uh, uh, to get through this morning. My name is Onye Muwazo Nanozi Abache. I am from our Inolo province in Biafra land. Anyangawala. Uh, During January like this, and I should go Ghana. Biafra was all over the world is Shekri. Ibanke Idama Ugo Gamiana is a morning time. My eyes have seen the eyes of the land of Isopo. The road from Enugu to Lagos is closed. My eyes have seen the new continent in the continent. My eyes have seen the onion do heading up up north with the thousands of Biafran soldiers, all of them wearing black. After Abuja is totally collapsed. Today Abuja is not there. My brother, you remember that uh, if you go biblically, what is going on now in the Biafra land, more especially our people, the Igbos, the so-called Igbos, the jealous people. They say to Moses, if you want to kill us as you kill the Egyptian, who made you king over us? Would you believe in Tampa Bay, Florida here? Ask anybody my engagement in the Florida Igbo, Florida, Igbo community in Florida here. Since the 1980s, we came here. I particularly formed the Igbo community of Tampa Bay. Ask anybody. They will tell you that. But do you know what, my brothers and sisters? Ndimo kanso yeno libo. Ndimo. Debu graham na mitin. Ndimo. Mwa 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 nye mwa wazo na nozea bachi e fomro. Ndimo debu graham na mitin. Why? Because na ingwa njuru ndimo. Why? Kunu ngeja poro nye yoba kozo tatale ono apa. Ndimo ni imo gama. Why not the color on you, mom? Why you on you, mom? Walk on you, mom. Cause what man who not fancy me, mom, gamma. Why can't you call an umbra? Abia, Enugu, Ebony. Somebody from Delta, Rivers, Apa, 
problem. Why can't call? Can, can't you call any of our people from the eastern region? Why do you call the Yoruba to to buy to contract? Why did you co contract a Yoruba to buy the fabric our women is going to wear? They took me out. All of them got against me. The buy was the my number. Okay, the number. Who made your king go over us? That's jealousy. That's what our people are. That's their DNA from the beginning. And that is why the Totoki, they allowed, like I've been saying, allowed in the vice of a time, their own chiefs and kings and leaders about 120 years ago, 50 years ago. My great-grandfather included to be killed by the British. They appointed as my great-grandfather and the others. Indeed, why did it? And I know them. History told us. And the person who did it, mostly from Uwere, who pointed at my great-grandfather, this is a king, this is a leader, this is the one that is, uh, these are the ones that are resisting you. Go ahead and get them and kill them. And the same thing is what they are doing today. But the time is coming, judgment time is coming to them. Judgment time is coming to them. It's a morning time. What our people have to do, you see, this morning I was reading from the social media. I saw Shaka, the head of the Boko Haram, saying, Leave Biafra, he said, anyway, Eastern region alone. Leave Eastern region alone, Biafra, I mean, uh, the Zulu soldiers. Leave them alone, leave Biafra alone, leave Eastern region alone. Come to the Zambisa forest and fight me for 30 minutes. That was uh, the breaking news this morning. You should go to Zambisa forest and fight me, not to Eastern region where there's peace. Who is fueling this very thing? Are they not Ohanes and Dibo? Are they not the governors and the Efulefus of Igbo land? That's the one fueling it. These people cannot come to our mama, to Amene, to Olu, to, you know, challenge go straight to where our people are staying in the bushes. Somebody must lead them there. That's the reality. Somebody must lead them there. We cannot be over the canon of Henagiga as with the Nangiga. That's the reality. Our people have been doing it for longest time. They cannot recognize their own. Who jinjad? Who jinjad that brother from Yoruba? Who called, who called him? Who woke him up? Now they are talking about the Yoruba man. They are not talking about their own man. My father said, Oh, my baby, Nacho, your brother is fighting with somebody else. Instead of helping, helping your brother to fight the enemy, you started fighting your own brother because you need the porridge of, 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 of water, I mean, yam. You need something. That will take you to the grave that you cannot even enjoy. My brother has to live here because I know I have a lot to talk about. And the way you accumulate a lot to talk about, your mind flows. Yes. You know, because I've been calling, like I said, I've been calling since this week. I mean, last week, my, my call is not going through. So I heard Biafra wanted the most understand that the inside security came to stay. Eastern security has been established. It's a rock. Immovable rock. Even when Biafra comes, it must be there forever and ever and ever. Yes, sir. My, you know, appeal to everybody, to all coordinators. The coordinators, you are also the leadership of this engagement. The DOS, the members, even our people back home, the agreeable and disagreeable ables. What you have to understand is that uh, we are fighting for everybody to safeguard, to make sure that we have freedom. Remember, I always say it every time. I am not happy being in America. I have been almost 40 years. I fought the war. I 
I'm, I'm a veteran. I fought the war. I am not happy that my kids, my children, we are adults now growing in America. My wife is not getting the women culture. She is not dumping with the American culture. My kids are dumping with the American culture. What a stupid culture is that? Instead of my own culture, the culture, real rich culture, culture is decided by Chukwa Kika Adriama. We abandon our own culture to live in the foreign land. Remember that I always say, my voice will call you from the foreign land. I'm a, I'm a sojourner in the foreign land. Why should I be in the foreign land? Abandon my own nation. Abandon my own indigenous. Abandon my own people to stay in a foreign land. We are not to recognize. Thank you, sir. We are yeah. recognized in Igbo land, in Biafra land. Thank you, my brother, for taking my call. Yeah. Oh, hey, Biafra. Oh, we are hey, going Biafra. home. Oh, hey, Biafra. I know. I don't know. I feel the emotion. I know he's... Everybody's thinking the same way. But you know something? Our our freedom is here. There is nothing anybody can do about it. Let me take this one. This I, was, I think this was a call that dropped off. Uh, caller, good morning. Tell us your name and what, what happened to your call. It's Rabbi, it's Rabbi Charles. I, I don't know. I was taken off from there. I don't know. No, don't the, know. The, the thing went off on your own side. It says a network failure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. It's, it's not from your side. It's from my side. Yes. They took me out because... Uh, it's okay. Go ahead, sir. So, I don't know where the thing cut me off from. Where I was. Not to repeat what I said before. Just go ahead. Just do what you have to do. And, uh, yes, I can do. Let me do what I got to do. Yes. I, please, I, I want to um, kind of uh, suggest to our brother that I just called now. Because one night, I am an Obi, you were the Ginobi. And you might have a in and the Yoruba. Where to Obi? Put to begin and because half of Tabago, Kayarach, Echegi, Kayarach, and I hear the go also. Because Onya, Onya Ibo, the group may have a Florida. I'm a mehem di bona and Nanya all the time. Hane and Nanya are the cost. Maybe Yoruba gave them cheaper. Maybe Yoruba, I'm not I'm not going against what you're saying. Maybe Yoruba man or woman or sister or brother gave them the cheaper rate. And he have a business. They go for they go for it. Only Yoruba, I am my work within the Yoruba, I work with them in my business in whatever I'm doing. And they know me, they know my stand. They respect me for that. So if they give me some if I ask them to give me something, you can't do without these guys, man. I had the connected. We have to face it. I eat the formidable. I I eat with that bravery. How man I eat the brave. Aisha Yusuf can right now. Let me go to her. Aisha Yusuf was was confronted just like our, our leader did. Our leader told them, Go to hell. I am going to do my evangelism. And he went on doing his evangelism. They caught Aisha Yusuf. He's a woman. She's, I think she's a single mother. And she has to feed herself and to take care of. If I, I stand to be corrected, either she's married, the husband will not like to lose the, the wife. Maybe the husband is not formidable, not strong enough to so say, Go ahead, soldier, or move on. No. And remember, she's not evil. She is not evil. They always play this risk, this tribalism card, and she fell into it. That is why she came up to be talking on something that doesn't even concern her. That something that is not her business. That is what she's doing because they threatened the woman. I know when they interviewed her. I know when they issued threat. I know when they told her, "If you rally around with the youth again, we're going to take you out." We didn't shoot you because we respected Islam. That's what they told the woman. If she said that what I'm saying is not correct, she can call Radio Biafra. I will give her time and date. Mazi, I put us in Dewo. Dewo, thank you very much. Like I said before, if you have somebody who has only 15 followers and they will make a noise and we bring it to Radio Biafra that has 70 million people listening to us, we are advertising that person. I don't know who Aisha Buhari is, or Zapu, Aisha, whatever. And job worry with the same people who don't care about these people. These people are not important, these people are not relevant. They can say just what about anything they want. And here we go to a stage where uh in my own way find a ball and one a boy born up and you know, we are just that level now. And I buy you by an app in the app because they are not important. Those people cannot do nothing. Nobody can change what we are doing. We're just giving them honor with honor does not it, they, that's what they don't deserve. They don't deserve any honor at all, at all, at all. I think I need to take just 
one more call and who's going to be that lucky one let let me take this one uh, on straight line call on straight line good morning tell us your name and where you're calling from good morning sir from here welcome to the uh, program my, my name is Mazen Mecca. i'm calling from Indiana police usa there we um condition this morning i just want to remind all these eastern governor and eastern eastern uh whatever uh, whatever whatever <laughs> whatever yes they claim they're educated but they didn't know that uh, all these west african countries gambia Senegal, full he doesn't have mouth. even could yeah fly doesn't have mouth there yeah it's true it's only in nigeria eh? full is controlling them in gambia yeah Yes, it's full of the person the president now. They don't have mouth, they don't have mouth. But now, but let me remind Eastern, Eastern governors and the, the old one Nigeria. I could remember five years ago, they call us uh, uh, Facebook wow, wow, wow warrior. You, yeah. show, you people just they talk, 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 talk. Even in the in the yeah, they call me radio, BBC, BBC, radio, Gibiabra. But now, everybody, this is just. Yes, they just do testing, testing. You know, you know the way DJ microphone. When did the MC want to? When DJ want to set his uh, music, his music. Yes. You be saying testing, testing. testing we are doing testing. I remember <laughs> Facebook war, 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 warrior. Uh, Facebook this. No, they can come back, come back. If you people are smart, you know what makes Facebook that's nine years old to be one of the powerful man in the world because Facebook control media. We have platform where it can propagate anything you want to, anything you want to, the people to believe. That's why Facebook. I want to complain about Facebook since people say at least I always. But Facebook do the same thing to the whole president of America. And now our leader have population of go get you to go get this man have to tell us the need of you to take our land. Saudi Arabia is number one of the political country in the world. Look up, Saudi Arabia gives number four. At least in the school, first position, I, I, I the first position give uh, number uh, fourth position, just more gap. But look at the development and civilization of Saudi Arabia to compare Nigeria for the first country. And if just people are still believing in Nigeria, do you people know that Dubai you people are going to take a picture? Nigeria have all you that are Dubai? Eh? And they must not kind of want to rescue us, people are coming. That's it. Sabotua, yeah, Sabotua. Time will come. People will be running at Ascata. At Ascata. Thank you. Mas, let me drop it here. Thank you. There you well. go. All right, this is Radio Biafra USA 2. Let's see if we can take uh, just one more call because I can have a little time to go. Uh, caller on um, Signal. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Caller on Signal, are you there? Otherwise, I have to call off this phone. All right, unfortunately, it's not ready to talk. And uh, with this, I have to bring this program to an end. Don't forget that uh, Mazia Lozia, USA 1, is coming in. So it's his turn to come in. And uh, like I said before, uh, this, uh, whoever they call, they said her name is uh, Yusuf. Yusuf, uh, is it Yusuf? Yes, Yusuf. I don't really, I thought Yusuf used to be a, man, a male name. I didn't know there's a woman answer Yusuf too. Oh, Aisha, I'm sorry. <laughs> Aisha, okay, whatever. Aisha, I don't know who Aisha is, but I've been made to understand that uh, she's a, a freedom fighter too. Okay, let me take this call. Let's see this one. Call on 845. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. You have just two minutes to talk. Yeah, uh, Mazi. Good afternoon from Germany. Naka is my name. Welcome to the program. Um, the Yusuf, uh, Aisha Yusuf. Yes. Actually, she comes from uh, um, Edo State. Her parents oh. are Edo people. They're from Auji, but uh, she was born and brought up in Kano. Oh, okay. Yeah, she's a Edo, Edo, Edo so lady. How, she how important, how is, important is she? How is she taking up my, my airwave this morning? Everybody's talking about, about the woman. No, I, I, actually, actually I, don't, I don't know why our people are making, because that she that lady has been tweeting, in, you know, randomly, you know. For example, you know, that lady and uh, Esther Questley, Esther Questley and uh, uh, um, the current uh, uh, chairman of Nash, Nigerian Port Authority, uh, Osman Bala, 
Haidiza uh, Osman or Bala, there were the people, these two, three women were those who started this, uh, uh, bring back our girls. Oh, okay, okay. She she was uh, with this, those three women started uh, bring up, bring back our girls in you know, a campaign, and after and she was really pro Buhari, pro Buhari's. I mean, three of them they were APC, they were pro Buhari's, and they, they brought Buhari into power. And after then you they are not they are now lamenting. Among three of them, the only person that was uh, selected or uh, uh, working with Buhari is that, that woman who is in charge of uh, port authority. And you know what port authorities are all about? That lady is a Fulani woman. I, I mean, uh, you know, Hadiza I Amina mean, uh, Bala Osman. She's a pure Fulani woman, and uh, all of them they're just very uh, very unhappy with uh, uh, with the Buhari administration because. Uh, Buhari did not give her any appointment, the same thing with our sister, or else a question. That's why they're attacking everybody, you know? <laughs> uh, you know, she's talking from both sides of her mouth. She would, today she will talk this, tomorrow she will talk that. But uh, she's out of, she's frustrated. And moreover, her, her children are living in, in Scotland. She's talk, her, 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 family, her families are not even living in Nigeria. So you see, you see the hypocrisy of our people. Our people are so, so hypocritical. Even the, the worst of them, yeah? look, Aisha Mohammed, Aisha Yusuf, it's not even, there are evil guys who are worse than her. There's this guy called Professor Chidi or Denkalo in Abuja. You go and see what that guy is, is, is tweeting about ECN. He was the first person who, uh, during that Olo crisis, he was the, he was the first person who tweeted militants, you know, clashing with, uh, with, with, uh, with Nigeria, Nigeria. Soldiers, militant, and the Professor Chidi Odinkalo was na the, the chairman of Nigerian Human Rights. Uh, again, 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 uh, you know, she's a professor of law, a very young man, maybe in his in uh, beginning fifties. Go and see what he tweets about Biafra, about the uh, about ECN. I don't know why people are making too much about uh, uh, Yusuf. There are other people you can, you know, there's one guy in the Enugu, that guy is a, is a medical doctor. Go and see what that guy is writing about IPO, IPO and Eastern, 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 Eastern uh, uh, Security. Even I confronted him on Twitter, he told me that he preferred Flanny Hestman than IPOB coming to his community. That it's what is for IPOB, IPOB, IPOB uh, Eastern, Security, uh, Eastern Security to work in his community, that he would deal with them. He's what, a medical doctor. He's what not, what he's is not, his what is his community? What does what does that mean? Enugu, Enugu. He said from Enugu. I'll, okay. I'll find that and I'll call back again maybe tomorrow. No, that I don't guy, want. I, I don't mean, want to know. When he says community, I was thinking that he has a group of people that are following him. These people, no, are, no, these people my brother, no. these people are not relevant. These people are lizards that I think that they are crocodile. They, 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 they are. Choose. But what I'm trying to emphasize is that uh, uh, Yusuf is not a, the only person. Talking rubbish. Um, more more ebos are horrible than uh, uh, this this lady. More ebos. At least I've seen I've seen her tweets where she is you know very 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 objective. You know, but there are many ebos who are prominent. Prominent ebos. Do you know Do you know that the current chairman of human rights in Nigeria in Nigeria is uh, is an ebo guy? Have you seen anything? Have you seen him tweet anything about about ebos or about how they say mass, you know massacres in ebo land? No. There's one guy called Clement Wankwo. Clement Wankwo is, uh, you know, is well known in Nigeria. You know, that guy has, you know, he only talks about all this, all this crisis in in, in, in northern Nigeria. All of them, they're, they're worse. We have worse people than Yusuf. People should not make her popular because Radio Biafra International is, I mean, Radio Biafra is 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 international and people listen. We are right. promoting that that lady. Thank you so much. All right, let's go. She 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 she's from she's a do woman, but grew up in in the north. Thank, thank you very much. God thank, bless you. Thank you so much. All right. Uh, in closing, what I have need to tell you guys is this: I was an entertainer. My life played music. There are some of us who think that we are we are we are up there, but you know something. When you're walking and you think they're following you, go look behind you. You discover that you are alone. Maybe one or two people read something that you write and that makes you think you are touching. You know, you know, Ngure, 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 Kasi, the blizzard will fall from the tree and drop down and look around, look around. Nobody says, he shakes his head and says, listen, if nobody to praise me, let me praise myself. These people are not important. 
These people are so irrelevant that when you talk about them, it turns my stomach. It's like I feel that I'm wasting my time. Let them come out. If they think they are popular, talking about, when they say community, I was like, maybe he has followers, he has people that are following him. The only way you can do this thing and prove it to me is come out, announce that you want your followers to come in the street and protest with you without giving them money or anything. You discover that you are all on your own. Nam Dekano comes out, he doesn't even call people. He says, I need two million men in Abuja and they are there. He doesn't have money to give to two million people. But they are there. That's what we call leaders. So when you compare our leader to these people, these people are not relevant. Believe me, the noise they make, look at it, take it this way. If they do not talk about IPOB or Nam Dekano, then they are nothing now. They are empty. If you take away, it's like in the church. Most of the churches that you go, you discover that the pastor is at the pulpit. He spends 95% 95 of his time talking about Satan. And the salvation itself, he gives it only three minutes. The other two minutes is probably for his personal uh, aggrandizement or aggradiation. It's the same thing with these people. Take away Nam Dekano and IPOB from their conversation, they are nothing. They will be empty. So they have to waste their time and talk about Namdi. But when we carry them along as if they are relevant, they hear these things, it gets on their brain. Oh, na na wow, they talk about me today for Radio Biafra. You know, let's say somebody I asked when I was in Nigeria about this movie industry, somebody came and said, you know, she, so, she was in the studio with other people. And they are claiming her as an actress. She's an actress, she's in Hollywood and all that. I said, yeah, okay. So what, where's your movie now? Make me watch so I can see you. And then one day my niece said, that my friend, you know, this is the movie that she is in. I said, okay, so where is she? And then we're waiting and said, don't you see? Look at her, look at her. <laughs> we started laughing and somebody said, she's just a waka pass. She's not a movie actress. So that's the same thing with these people. These people are waka pass. They have nothing to offer, nothing to make them relevant. If they don't call Nam Dekano and challenge Nam Dekano and challenge that POB, no. They will just, their posts will just stay there and nobody will even look at it. They think they have followers. But when the time comes, they will know that they have nobody there on their own. What we are saying, our leader has spoken. 14 days, that's what you guys have. That those in Isukwato, we are sorry about what is happening there because you know we are, you are all beer friends. Our leader is going to take care of this and he knows truly what he's going to do. We're going to stop all that menace in that area. All these people forget about them that come to the radio to say, hey, they, they saw the Boho has done this. Done this. These people are all hypocrites. There are people who cannot swallow their pride. There are people who cannot say, listen, this man has done enough. I am sorry. I lift my hand. You know, when I watch young kids in America when they are fighting in the street, and when they pump, punch, 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 and the other one says, time out. It's time to go. He raises his hand, he's walking away. You see them. That is, when they punch him and he feels the punch is enough, he gets off his hand and says, he has surrendered. You guys should surrender and stop fooling yourself. Nam Dekano has gone beyond. It's not your class. Honestly speaking, most of us wasting our time Talking about you guys is just a waste of time. You can talk all you want, my dear. You can talk, roll yourself down, condemn us from head to toe. It doesn't make any difference. It will not change anything. Biafra is here to stay, regardless of what you think. No matter how much you try, you cannot stop us. We are here, unstoppable, and that is what it is. So you can be here crying all you want, making all the noise you want, you know, it does not stop us because we are here to actualize our, our current, con our country. Our country is Biafra and Biafra is what we are going to get regardless of what anybody says. So stay tuned, don't go away because Mazi Alozier is here to stay. Mazi Alozier is coming in next. I'm um, trying to get, to get to my post. <laughs> Facebook, sometimes they make, they, they, they just, these computer things, they get me crazy. All right, don't forget, I still have to remind you that um, Biafra is our religion, all right? And uh, Radio Biafra is where we worship. Be with you again tomorrow at the same time. From me, it's goodbye. 
Let's make room for Mazi Alonso that is coming in right now. Stay tuned, don't go away. <laughs> 